this holiday season, you can give the gift of reading through Bookworm of Edwards. Joining me now, Sarah Taylor. Sarah, you've been at Bookworm for how long now? Going on five years. Five years? Yeah. So I love Bookworm. I love the location. You have yeah. a great selection, a really cool cafe, but you have something really special going on right now that will give back books to the community. Yeah. So we just launched our Adopt-A-Reader program, which is a program that is just everything that we want it to be as a local bookstore. Um, it's a program where we've reached out and partnered with um, organizations in the community to find kids in need who can't afford books on a regular basis. And um, we're working with people in the community who want to sign up for this program um, where they can sign up for $20 a month uh, for a whole year and send books to these kids, which is just so exciting. Um, so we just launched it a few weeks ago. We've already gotten a great response, but we have a lot of kids in our program that need to be adopted. So um, yeah, it's a really cool thing. So what kind of books would the children be getting if uh, you became a sponsor for that? It completely depends on the age. So the kids will remain anonymous, um, but you'll know the age and gender of the kid. And then um, for, for infants and for toddlers, we have board books and picture books. And um, we kind of just base it off of their age. So the older they get, we'll move them into beginning chapters to early readers and then up into chapter books. So. And so when, uh, when we go to, to donate, can we do this through their website? And you mm -hmm. said it's a year-long commitment? It's a year-long commitment, so they'll get a book every month um, for a year, and then of course we'll follow up, and if you want to continue for another year, um, then we can certainly arrange for that. But um, yeah, there's a form on our website. You go under the gifts tab on our website, and then um, there's a form to fill out, and you can also call the store or talk to me. I'd love to talk to people about it. Here's a look at the flyer that uh, is for the Adopt a Reader program. Now, you're a partner with Literacy Project for this. Tell mm -hmm. me a little bit about that. Yeah, so we, we love the Literacy Project. We've worked with them a lot before. And when this idea kind of came to us, they were some of the first people we reached out to. Um, and they um, reached out to their people and found all these kids who would love to read and love that opportunity, but just don't have that um, in their life at the moment and so we've gotten to partner with them and we've already had a few kids adopted and we've gotten their books before Christmas and it's just it's been so cool to see um, these kids just kind of light up when they are given a book that they wouldn't have otherwise had. Reading so important I, I especially think for the youth because mm -hmm. it can really trigger your imagination. Yeah. How do you pick which kids are getting the books? Um, so the kids are just based on, well, right now we have a tree <laughs> in the store um, that have all of the kids that are currently um, waiting to be adopted. And so like, there's little tags that say the age of the kid and um, um, whether it's a boy or a girl. So we've had a lot of people who have already adopted and um, they kind of base it off of that. I know one woman came in and really wanted someone who was between six and eight because that age was really special to her. Um, just giving those kids the books that they need to to gain their literacy skills, and um, there's a lot of, of lot of babies who <laughs> really just need those that introduction into reading as well. Um, so that's kind of how we base it off of the program. So Sarah, where can we go to donate and become a part of Adopt a Reader? Um, definitely call the store, um, talk to us, but the form online um, is the best way, it's the easiest way, um, and we'll follow up with you as soon as you fill it out. Um, but all of that information, once you submit that form, will go directly to me. Great. Thank you so much, yeah. Sarah. It's bookwormofedwards.com to go ahead and get registered so you can be a part of the Adopt a Reader program. Coming up next, Mark Sassy has a quick look at your weather forecast.